Okay guys, so for this, um, I'm gonna go ahead and put on nose pads. Um, first of all, our tools that we're using is our screwdriver with the blade. Um, we're going to be using our nose pad plier. And we're going to be using the cutting plier. So first off, you don't wanna scratch the lens ever. So you're gonna go ahead and move this towards this side. You're gonna move this towards this side using your tools correctly because you want to separate them from the lens okay you never wanted the lens because you can get them scratched okay what we're gonna do is you can tell they're screw on because you know they have like the little hole to put the screw these are very tiny screws um so what you want to do is you're going to put in the nose pad here um i don't think Unfortunately, we don't have the tool to go ahead to pick up the screw, so we're going to have to use it with our nails. When you don't have long nails, it's a little bit hard, but since the screw is big, it's possible. So you're going to put the screw in there. You're going to want to put your hands here because you do not want to scratch the lens. You know, have some support. You want to hold the tool like this, this here, handing on your hand. You're going to want to go like this. You know, and then screw on. Just be very careful because you see. Just make sure you hold a tight grip. You want to leave them tight so that they don't fall off. Okay. There you go. You have one on. We'll worry about cutting them later. Then we're gonna go ahead and continue and do, if you're doing one or doing the other, always remember, you know, the fat surface goes towards the top. This one does it. You can hold it like this. You can have different ways of holding it. Since the screw's long, it's very easy to maneuver. You make sure it's put within. You put your finger here, you do not want to scratch the patient's lens because that means you're going to have to remake the lens and that is money. And you don't want to take forever either. I'm taking a little bit longer because I'm talking through the process. But this is what screw on nose pads look like. So they're screwed on. You see? Now the frame has nose pads. Obviously, we grab them back and we bring them back to their original place. But we notice that the screw is a little big. So we're going to bring it back here to give us space to cut the screw. Sorry. We're going to bring it back here to give us space to cut the screw with what our cutting plier which you would do in regular situations in more regular situations we would have screws that are more smaller that are actually for nose pads since this is not the situation then we're gonna have to leave them like this but we usually never leave them like this so then after we're done what we do is grab this correctly and put our nose pack back in place always making sure everything is aligned you know with our nose pad plier always making sure we know how to use our tools and 
and there you go. We can't even do an angling. And now the frame has nose pads. Bam, bam.